you been here before? Well, this is Think Film Leaf 74. <laughs> well, you haven't been to 74 yet unless you're watching this video again. Let Think Film Leaf 74. 74, yeah, Think Film Leaf 74. Whoa, <laughs> you've been here before? If you've been listening to these videos in sex, in success, in success, in su succession, then you kind of, you kind of, kind of, you have been kind of, kind of been here before. You're gonna be here before, yeah. You kind of been here before. You're gonna, you're gonna, kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of. Well, you know, no, you know, let me know, you know, no. I just reeling off everything, you know. I just reeling off everything, you know. And then, then I, and then I, and then I. <sighs> kind of going off just a. A little bit of the last video, having to face your fears, worries, concerns, and doubts, and all that gobbledygook that goes along with it. But, you know, here's the thing, is that, oh gosh, and this is one part of humanity I just can't stand in a way, you know, wish you could just shut it off, and what is that? Emotions. Emotions. Because emotions will, oh man, emotions rule people's lives. I mean, they do. You know, it's about, it's all about how I feel today and what I'm doing is about how I feel today and it's about how I feel today. If I know if I can do that, if I feel, you know. I mean, sometimes, you know, and gosh, just being honest with you here, you know, coming down here, coming down here, coming down here, doing some of these videos sometimes that I do, or I what I do is, uh, what, I, what I have been done, what I've been faced with sometimes is just the sure simple fact is like, I don't feel like, you know, the fuel, you know, all feel like, you know, but you know, I had to push through that. I had to push through that and, and get pushed past how I was feeling and everything and just come down here. And you know, it's just like, it's just like walking. It's just like putting one step in front of the other and just keep walking. Just keep t taking steps. Just keep driving. Just keep moving. That's faith. You know, sometimes that's faith in the in the midst of the difficulty and in the trenches and the fighting and when you're trying to create change in your life uh, for uh, for things that are going to be be better or uh, but they're going to be they're going to be better for you. Of course they are. Making things in your life that are going to be better, that are going to take you to a higher level, that are going to help you accomplish your dreams, that are going to help you accomplish, uh, you know, the things that you desire, the desire for yourself. And along that journey, along that journey, if you're a human being, you're going to be dealing with feelings. Yeah. If you're a human being, you're going to have to be dealing with feelings. Mm -hmm. And sometimes those feelings are not so good. Not so good because, because we're, we're faced in life with always getting knocked around by one thing or the other. I mean, if it's whatever's in the press, if it's whatever's in the news, if it's whatever that's going on in our family, we're going to be constantly being dealing with that. Dealing, we're constantly, as human beings, we're going to have to be constantly dealing with feelings, okay? As human beings, we're going to have to be constantly dealing with feelings. And if you understand that, you can take note to that, you, you got to pay attention to that part of yourself too. And uh, understand the fact that if you know that we are, uh, I, I got to tell you, as as human beings on this on this on this on this on this planet, as human beings, we are. I mean, I can't even tell you. Um, I, I was just kind of made aware of it for whatever reasons. Probably because I'm done. Whatever reasons. We as humans are incredibly sensitive. I mean, you can sit there and people can sit there. Well, I'm not really sensitive. I don't, no, if you if you're a person that sits there, well, I'm not really sensitive. You know what you are? You're a person who has hardened themselves to a lot of things because. In the very beginning as a child, when you haven't been exposed to anything, we are incredibly sensitive. You know, to think about to think about that you can say something to somebody one time and it can stick and resonate in their lives and change them for the rest of their life. You could say one thing, five minutes in a conversation to a child, you could say something to them and it can change how they think, feel, and believe about themselves for the rest of their lives by doing that kind of stuff. So, you know, there's there's so much power so much power out there that affects us that bombards us that we react to because of the feelings and because of the emotional reaction to things mm -hmm. 
And so as a young person, as a, as a young person, as a child, you know, you can't, you're not really aware of this. And I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope that there's a lot of young folks that are out there listening to these videos because, because getting a hold of this kind of stuff now as a young individual, you're going to be able to steer yourself clear. You could be able to direct and steer yourself clear from a lot of difficulties and tyranny in your life. Because as I see it, as I see it in this world, in this world, because we're in spiritual warfare, I don't know if, you know, if you can, um, I mean, I mean, we don't get into that conversation, but you know how, you know, there's this, let's, the, the point, the point I'm trying to make is that this world is just not getting any easier and more pleasant, you know? It's just like the heat's been turned up and the intensity's going but that, 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 I think film believe differently about that too for kind of what's going on in our world is that it's good because a lot of that stuff needed to happen. A lot of the pot needed to be stirred. So <clears throat> that's not what you're trying to talk about here. But well, I mean, let's just say for a moment here that all the pot, the pot that's being stirred and a lot of things that are taking place and happening in the world right now, right? Are caught, we're getting, emo we're, if, if you're, if you're caught up in all of it, and which I am just partially, just, I just partially, um, I'm emotionally reacting to that myself, you know? So, and you know, the thing that I'm working on the most I'm one of the things that I'm not the most, not the most, one of the things that I'm working on right now is not to allow myself to react to it anymore and to detach. I mean, if that would be the key thing that we can do is, 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 is detach, detach. And that doesn't mean that you're irresponsible by, I don't care, I'm not, you know, I don't care, I don't, you know, not. that's not what it is. That's detach, <clears throat> detaching. Listen up, because it's pretty big. Detaching is detaching from things from yourself emotionally. Not allowing yourself to react to it and allow it to affect your emotions, right? That's what detachment is. Uh, it's deta detachment is, is letting go of the emotional response to it. Because that's huge. I mean... That is so huge. If you could put that on a three by five card for yourself and realize that detaching from things is detaching from the emotional response uh, that you're getting. Because you can still be tuned in consciously, right? You can still be tuned in with your brain, with your brain. You can, you can be, you can be tuned with your membrane. You can be tuned with your brain. <laughs> yeah, you can be tuned with your membrane. You can be tuned in with your brain. You can be tuned in with your brain, but you don't have to be tuned in to your emotions. And that, my friend, is critical. That is critical. That is critical to be able for you to actually create change in your life in anything. Right? That's another one. That's another that one. That that one. I had no idea that that one was coming, but it came. It came. It came. It came. Detaching is detaching away from things with your emotional response to it, and having peace that there is an order and that things are going to take place. And you know what? Here's the thing that people do: is that they they uh, the people that are just out of control with their emotions and their lives are driven constantly by emotions all the time, by how they feel all the time about all those kinds of stuff. You know, and that's direct their lives too by how they feel about everything uh, you know because feelings are feelings are the paramount item uh, that is one of the keys to be able to uh, change uh, create and be tormented by and that's primarily your feelings and your emotional response to everything so you know there's there's a huge there's huge uh, there's huge amount of wisdom there oh uh, there's huge amount of wisdom there and that's detaching from your emotional response you know whatever it is that's happening out there i mean if you can somehow and that's a that's a tall tall order sometimes you know detaching from yourself uh detaching from things emotionally detaching from things emotionally you know and like i said doesn't mean that you're responsible now because you still got your mind and you can still reason on an intelligent and intellectual level just 
realize that your life is being driven by emotions and um, you need to detach sometimes and not allow emotions to rule you and and make your life a move down the path. Eh? 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 <laughs>